This is how to find NPV or net present value on our HP 12C financial calculator. So for this problem, we're going to first start with our initial investment. So let's just imagine we're at a company and we want to do a project, but we want to know our net present value. First, we're going to have to put down some money. So at time zero, we're going to put down $65,000. So how you enter that into your calculator, we're going to enter 65,000, six, five, one, two, three. And since it's going out of our account, it's going to be negative. So how you make that negative is pressing CHS, and then to input it into CF zero, which is cash flow at zero times zero, all we have to do is press GPV. There we go. Next, we're going to have um, cash flow. So there are two ways of entering this. For this problem, we're going to have $12,000 inflow of cash flow for nine years. So the first way to do it, you can enter 12,000 and then press um, that to see um, FJ 12 times, but I mean nine times, but we don't really wanna do that, especially when it, maybe it's a hundred years, who knows? I'll show you a little life hack. All we have to do is press 12,000 and we're gonna sign that to CFJ. And then if we know it's nine years of this cash flow, we can just go nine G and then when we press F V, that's gonna activate N J, so the number of years, and that that should do it. You don't have to enter it nine times and also don't put nine into N for years, even though we normally would do that. Um we just have one more piece of information. Our WAC or our I is gonna be nine as well, so we can just press nine I. And then to find our net present value. All we have to do is press um, F and then where is it? PV is going to enter, um, it's going to give us that number and there we go. Hope this helps.